I'm really proud of our seniors. Mike, Mike, you talk about setting the tone for us, all three of them. Obviously, Johnny was Superman, but I thought all three of them really set the tone for us in a very important game. Um, again, our I think our offensive efficiency has been good. It hasn't already. It hasn't always uh, come out with wins, but the last two, you know, offensively, we're scoring and we're confident when we're getting to the foul line a little bit more. Like, what, is it, what does it mean to you guys when you're able to get to 80? I think that's four in a row yeah. now. That, that used to be. God, that used to be our thing, right? Get it to 80, see 40 at halftime, you know? And and uh, and so, I, you know, again, it it's amazing. They had 20 offensive rebounds and you win by eight. Again, those, those putbacks are two. They count two. And if you're efficient offensively, and that's kind of how we've that's our culture, or maybe that's how we gamble <laughs> for 20 years. Can we be out efficient them offensively and get enough defensive rebounds at the time? So, yeah, I think offensively, I think we're feeling pretty good about ourselves. You basically uh, patented that small ball lineup now. Uh, yeah. Kind of talk about how you dealt with their twin towers. That yeah, we were uh, praying it would bounce to us on a, the first miss, and um, Johnny became you know, really good in the second half. But I thought our guards came down. And I can't say enough about Rex Fluger. And I know he's he's starting to shoot the ball and score for us a little bit. But the fighting, physical, winning plays that the guy continually makes is amazing. And, um, you know, so we held our own. And as they're tipping it and everybody's saying, oh, my God, we got to get a big guy in there to rebound. I go, wait a minute, they got to guard us on the other end. And I feel the last two games were just harder to guard and we can absorb some of that shock. Even though the one time the guy missed and just went up and dunked on five guys, I'm like, well, maybe we should rethink this. But uh, it, they're con we're confident offensively. If we can score, if you can score 75 and 80, you're going to be in, you know, you're going to have a chance to win every game. A different feeling from the group that you maybe I mean, I know it's two in a row, but it yeah. feels like they believe they are yeah. going to win the game. And now. we got to build on it a little bit. You know, I thought the other night, Wake cuts at the three. We were up 10. We call a timeout. We come out. I thought we were very matter of fact about winning the game. I thought tonight in the second half, today in the second half, we were very matter of fact about we're going to get a good offensive possession. We're going to do, we're going to get, we're going to get the key rebound. Rex going to take the key charge. So, yeah, I, I think we can build on this. And, you know, you, uh, if you can, you know, 500 in this, if you can, if you can hang around 500 in this league, you, you're going to be within striking distance down the stretch. So, you know, uh, but, yeah, I think something to build on. Well, they shot 36% from the floor. I know those putbacks were kind of hard to absorb a little bit, but I mean, our, you know, the the they shot 40, excuse me, for the game, which is pretty good. You know, field goal percentage defense. Um, you know, and again, they they we didn't want to overhelp because if they make two threes in a row, and I know that's not a strength of theirs, but sometimes guys that can't make threes make them, and then the whole complexion changes. Thought we did a good job of walling up on their big guys and making them take tough shots, and those counted too. And um, you know, and and we helped off of people, and and we rebounded enough to win the game. What do you say you've been working a lot in Las Vegas on his defense and trying to be better at that? But is that the thing that he's? I thought he was. With? Yeah, I thought he was better tonight. Johnny gets a little excited when he's behind a post guy. And the guy goes into his move and, you know, fakes him. He gets up in the air sometimes. Now, he is such – that it may be his best athletic attribute, the, the quick bounce. That's why he's the leading rebounder in the country. And the second bounce and the third bounce. So it's kind of ingrained. That's the kind of athlete he is. So to tell an athlete like that, stay on the ground, you know, and, and stay down – I thought he did a better job tonight making those guys make stuff over him and not fouling and not giving up angles. The other thing is if he stays on the ground, I told him, I said, Johnny, the jump I want you to have is the one to get the rebound, not the one when you go for the – when you're coiled and he takes – you can turn and then use an amazing gift to just go and that, that have that jump to go get the ball. 
about on the offensive end? Is there something that he's fine tuned from last year to this season? Well, it made some jump shots for us. But then the catch 22 early in the second half is when we have the big lineup in, he's out more and Jawan's in. And I'm not saying not shoot threes because I think he made two in the second half. But when we downshifted the lineup and he is rolling and he's got perimeter guys around him that can stretch the defense and he's playing one-on-one -on -one in the post or driving from the elbow with spacing, there's where he – there's where he's really good. And that's what we've substituted to. And you get back on the other end and you just got to hold your own and, and hope you can escape. And tonight was the ultimate test. They kept playing big. We kept playing small. Something was going to give at some point. We got better. We were just better offensively and harder to guard enough. Tell you, he's a tough dude, man. He's really, he's really grown for us. You know, I mean, it's, he gets 14 every game, doesn't he? I mean, it's like he comes off, he gets you 14. He's hunting his shot. He's aggressive, and uh, I, I really, really feel good. You know where where he is. You know, Prentice gave us a good floor game. I mean, he, he didn't score it for us tonight, but he had five assists. And um, but Dane is. Very confident guy right now. Thank you. Thank you.